With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, here the given question is the amount of barium sulfate formed upon mixing 100 ml of 20.8% barium chloride solution with 50 ml 9.8% H2SO4 solution will be. Here we have been given a reaction. So the reaction proceeds as BaCl2 plus H2SO4 gives barium sulfate plus 2HCl. This is a double displacement reaction. Double displacement reaction. So if we see one mole of barium chloride on reaction with 1 mole of H2SO4 will give 1 mole of barium sulfate and 2 moles of HCl. So here if we look at what are the given quantities to us, given is 100 ml 20.8% barium chloride solution, BaCl2 solution and so first one is this and the second one is 50 ml 50 ml of 9.8 percent 9.8 percent h2so4 so first we can calculate mass of barium chloride so the mass given here of for barium is 137 and chlorine 35.5 so 137 plus 35.5 into 2 as 2 chlorine atoms are there. So this is 137 plus 71 which is equals to 280 grams per mole. And similarly mass of H2SO4. So hydrogen has 1 each plus 32 which is of sulfur and 16 for oxygen into 4. So this comes out to be 98 grams per mole. Hence, if we see the number of moles, to calculate number of moles of each present, we can have this solution. So 100 ml 20.8 percent. These percent are given as mass percents. Mass percents. Hence, 20.8 grams is present in 100 ml. So, number of moles, number of moles of PaCl2 would be equals to 20.8 gram divided by its molecular weight, which we found out to be 208 grams per mole. Hence, number of moles would be equals to 0 0.1 mole. And now if we see, it was given as 50 ml, 9.8% of H2SO4. So if we see that 9.8 grams is present in 100 ml of H2SO4. But if we see that it is being given to us as 50 ml. So we have to divide it by in the equation. So if we see number of moles would be given mass divided by molecular mass. <coughs> so given mass is given as 9.8 grams in 100 ml therefore in 50 ml it would be the half of this which is 4.9 grams in 50 ml so now if we calculate the number of moles it would be 4.9 divided by 98 which comes out to be 0 0.05 moles hence now if we see in the reaction given it's one mole of barium chloride plus one mole of H2SO4 gives the 
product as one mole of barium sulfate. Now here we have given 0 0.1 mole of barium chloride BaCl2 and 0 0.05 mole of H2SO4. Hence here H2SO4 becomes the limiting reagent as it is present in less quantity as the ratio was required as 1 is to 1 hence as 0 0.05 moles of H2SO4 is only present therefore only 0 0.05 moles of BaCl2 would also react 0 0.05 mole of BaCl2 will react Hence, according to the reaction, barium chloride plus H2SO4 giving barium sulfate plus 2HCl. Now, H2SO4 is 0 0.05 moles. Hence, 0 0.05 moles of barium chloride would be reacted and the rest would be in excess. This will give as 1 is to 1 is to 1 ratio is there. So, if these are reacted in 0 0.05 moles barium sulfate generated would also be 0 0.05 moles and HCl would be generated 2 into 0 0.05 moles. Now we have to calculate the mass mass of barium sulfate generated after the reaction. So if we see Number of moles of barium sulfate formed are 0 0.05 moles. Therefore, mass of 0 0.05 moles barium sulfate would be equals to 0 0.05 multiplied by molecular weight. So molecular weight of barium sulfate for barium it is given as 137, sulfur is 32 and oxygen it's 16 and 4 atoms are present. Hence the mass comes out to be 233 grams per mole. Therefore Mass of 0 0.05 moles barium sulfate would be 0 0.05 into 233, which is equal to 11.65 grams. So the answer is 11.65 grams. So here it is option B. Answer is option B, which is 11.65 grams of barium sulfate would be formed. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.